What's up guys, Justin here with thesketchupessentials.com back with another SketchUp quick tutorial for you this week. So in the past we've come in here and we've done a tutorial where we've created a sphere. Well now what we're going to do is we're going to come in here and we're going to create kind of an egg shape. So kind of an oblong shape similar to a sphere. So what we're going to do is you're going to start off and you're going to go ahead and uh, create a circle like this using the circle tool. And then um, you're going to use the circle tool again. So activate the circle tool and tap that right arrow key. That'll lock your circle tool to the red axis. So what you're going to do is you're going to come in here and you're going to draw that circle. And then uh, once you have that circle drawn, um, you're going to go ahead and we don't want to mess up our path right here. So what you're going to do is you're just going to draw a line so that this is its own face. And then you're going to erase everything else. You've got kind of a quarter of a circle here. So I'll come in here and fill this face in. And then uh, you're going to go ahead and select this path right here. Um, and you're going to use the follow me tool. To extrude this so that you have a half circle just like this so and it really doesn't matter if you have a face on this bottom side or not what you so you you've created a half circle what you're gonna do is use that move tool um, to create a copy so create a copy right over here um, and again that's just activate the move tool and then uh, click on this object and tap that control key now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna rotate this copy that we made 180 degrees so you've got the bottom half of your shape right here and then uh, what you can do is you can go ahead and you can move it back over where it was before so you can go ahead and move it so you've got a complete sphere right here it's just two different halves so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna modify this second half that we just created and we're going to stretch it using the scale tool so to do that you're just going to come in here and you're going to click on this face you're going to tap that s key to activate the scale tool and then uh, you got all these grips in here you want to select this bottom grip just like this and kind of drag it down so once you've dragged it down basically what you did is you just took your half sphere and you just stretched it this way so it's longer so now you've got an egg shape in here and uh, you can come in here with the erase tool and uh, hold shift to um, whoops you can hold shift to go ahead and hide this line if you want to if you want this to be a continuous um, uninterrupted surface it really doesn't affect the way that this whole thing works but you can go ahead and do that to make everything look really clean. You can also come in here and select your two faces and right click and click reverse faces. So that's how you create kind of an oblong egg shape in SketchUp. So anyway, hope you enjoyed this quick tutorial. Um, leave a comment below. Let me know what you thought. Um, also, if you wouldn't mind taking a second and clicking that like button, I'd really appreciate it. That really helps me out. And uh, as always, I'm coming out with new SketchUp content every week. I'd love to have you along for the ride, so make sure you click that subscribe button. So thank you very much, and I'll catch you in the next tutorial.